Money Walmart, how can I help you? Hi, I need to talk to somebody about the uh, melons. The melons? Yeah. Sorry. Can I help you? Yeah, is it... You guys know, you get, is this, can I talk to you about the melons here? Can you talk to me about the melons? Yeah. What melons? Well, uh, Grandma was in the store today and she, she grabbed musk melon on, well, she wanted a canary melon and she, she well, she could have swore she had the canary melon and then she got home and I was like, well, that looks like a good musk melon there. She goes, oh, this is a canary and she, she cut it open and the damn thing ended up being a honeydew and, well, now we're all messed up, but. She didn't, we ain't gonna eat a honeydew here, I mean, she wanted the canary, so would you guys accept the return if she brought back the muskmelon? Uh, you know, if, if she's not satisfied with it, we can take her back, we can't sell it again or anything, but, but, yeah, we could, you know, if she think it was what she wanted, we can take it back and throw it away and let her live to find it for that. Give her, right. give her a reason for that. Alright, well. It's caught up because I mean, well, we're supposed to have dinner today here, and she cut it up, but. Yeah, I thought it's not about you. If you want to bring it in and just say it's not what you wanted, uh, and uh, I'll just have to keep it. All right, because I mean, the grandkids, they each took a bite out of it, and they go, well, oh, Grandma, this ain't canary. Yeah, well, I mean, that's what I said. I mean, we can't sell it again, but I'll give you your money back if you want to bring it back to the bag or something. No. Actually, just throw it away and whatever, I'll give you your credit for. Well, you gonna? Am I gonna get a full straight up trade for the canary then, or how's that gonna work? Just, just, uh, just what, what I want you to do: circle your receipt there, and put down Scott said uh, refund. You know, whatever it's two bucks or whatever it is. What? It's, uh, those are two dollar melons or something. Yeah. What's your name? Huh? What's your name? Scott. Scott said refund. And then just, just put down bad melon. Bad melon. And well, the melon was fine, I mean, it was fine, yeah, but... Just put down that melon, though. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> and then, and tell, uh, then when they come in, they won't ask any questions, they'll give you a refund for it. Put down that he talked to Scott, and, uh, and then she can know what she wants. I mean, Grandma was in it, and <laughs> this would have been about the third bad melon I've seen over the week, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Alright. Hey, if you want to do that, when are you going to be coming in? Uh... What 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 is the time? Uh, right now it's about yeah. ten thirty. Um, would it would it work if I still came in tonight? That's fine. Come in tonight too. That's fine. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you, sir. Bye. I'm glad. Call the Redmond Walmart Supercenter. I'll make Dirk your call. Well, hi, Dirk. Can I just talk to the produce? This is an emergency. So, Jerry. Hi, um, well... Yeah, what can we, I do for you? We went there today with the with the kids, and, well, little Jeremy, he took some grapes, and he took three, three grapes he ate there, and I was just wondering if we should come in and pay for them, because, I don't know, that'd be just a few, you know, a little bit of a pounder, but I'm just nervous, you know, do you want any, us, what should we do here with this situation? Um, okay, let's see. Okay, you, you you got some stuff, and you what you want to come in and pay for it now? Is no, that what you're saying? no. He my my grandson tried the grapes there. He just took three and ate them in a store. Oh. I punished him. He has been in his room, but he. I I mean I know it's not much. It's probably just you know under a nickel or something, but. Oh, don't worry about it. Are you sure? I mean. Yeah. No. No problem. Don't worry about it. Well. Me and me and the missus, we've been worried. We don't just don't know what to do with them. Um, yeah, yeah, that's okay. We're we're cool with that. It happened. Yeah. Um, okay. Do you, have, do you have any suggestions that we should do to teach him not to do this? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that could be a tough one, but. Uh, you sure you? you know, we, we could we could like next time you come in and if he did it we could like scold him. You know what I mean to make it. The yeah, make a scare. yeah make make a big scene. Yeah. Scare him. Well, I just I I just you know I don't want to raise a little stealer. You know it's not what anybody wants to do. Yeah. Yeah, we could do we could do that. I mean, just you know, kind of let him do 
what he thinks he's doing okay, and then... Well, yeah, we'll, we'll, me, and, me and the miss can talk it over and see, see what we think we're going to do. I mean, I know he's he's been grounded, and... All right, sounds good. Thank you for your time. You have a good night. You too, there. Yeah, bye. Thank you for calling the St. Chris Falls Walmart. How may I help you? Yes, can you connect me with the pop department? Hello, is this the pop department? Yes. Um, I was drinking my pop. Well, I bought a 12-pack of that Coke, and then I was looking in there, and there's a Diet Coke in there, inside the Coke. Okay. I'm not sure how that happened. Well, I don't know. I really need to get it fixed, because if you guys are trying to send me a message or something, I don't really know. But it's not funny. Okay. Well, you're going to have to bring it in, I guess. Okay, I'll, I'll bring the Coke and the Diet Coke in. You buy, just bring it into customer service. Now, can I exchange this for something else? I'm not really sure. I I just stock the shelves at night. I mean, yeah. it's customer service that deals with returns and such. Well, I uh, want some Fanta instead of this diet, because I'm not impressed with your service with the Coke products. I might switch over to Pepsi. Okay, well, um, Pepsi and Coke have their own vendors that come in and stock that stuff, so... Well, I mean, will you uh, complain to them? Can you promise me that you'll talk to them? I messed up somehow, I don't know. But, uh, like I said, just, uh, you know, bring in whatever you're unhappy with and bring it to customer service and they can help you out. Well, well, I'll try, but you have a nice time. But will you check all the all the packages? Because if this happens to other customers, you're going to have a lot of phone calls. All right. All right. Good. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, too. Goodbye.